I'm having so much fun on Nisha Day, and I was dying to be in this segment with you because you wanted to talk makeup over 40. Came in this morning, Missy Lovett, makeup artist extraordinaire, has created this look for you today. You walked out and I was like, holy cow, that is so natural, so youthful. What is happening? So Missy and I have talked a lot about this, about the trends, because I love the trends, mm -hmm. you love the trends, yeah. the latest and greatest in makeup, but oftentimes when you're 40 plus, you yes. can't wear them the same way. No, and it's like heartbreaking. You wake up one day and you're like, what happened? <laughs> I think you mentioned this, you're like, where's my face? Where'd my what? face go? I don't look the same. Well, I, I feel like I lost a cheek. Yeah, yeah. I slept so, on this side and now it's gone. There are some things that we can do, luckily, right, that we can incorporate into our beauty routines to help. So today I'm actually gonna throw some stuff on me, but first and foremost, as we age, our skin dries out. That is the biggest thing I see in all of my clients, especially those that live in Utah, we dry out. And everything you put on top, it just makes it look worse. Like you get that alligator skin, right? Yeah, sometimes you think more, I need to cover yes. more. But yes. as you age and your skin maybe has a little bit more fine lines to it, you mm -hmm. don't want to cake that. But I think the tough no. part in that, then you say, but I still want coverage. I don't mm -hmm. want to cake it Absolutely. on. Absolutely. So you probably still have your full coverage foundation. And Which one of the brands for skincare that is my go-to, you hear me talk about it all the time, Olay. I will say ole, 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 because they are my favorite. Now, I actually have, this is what's on my countertop. I have all five of these, but the one I wanted to introduce you guys to for those over 40 and really anyone that needs more hydration is their Collagen Peptide 24. This is their advanced facial moisturizer. So what it does for you is it has such small molecules that it penetrates the skin. Where other moisturizers don't, they sit on the skin and then you go to do your makeup and it's just not looking good, right? What's so great about this line too is it's affordable. Yes. Some of those you hear about and you say, but I can't do $300. Yeah. Well, guess what? You, you can don't, do this. You don't have to. Clinical studies have shown that this will hydrate your skin better than that $400 moisturizer. Mm. Tried and, and I've true. owned it, so I know for a fact So do you mix a little bit of that I'm with like your foundation? I'm a mixologist. I what? mix all kinds mm -hmm. of things. I've not yeah. done that. So that's what you can do. If you have that full coverage foundation, like I've got some here, okay. you can just take your foundation, um, and see what brand do you like? So my favorite right now is Estee Lauder, their double wear. Um, on today though, we use Giorgio Armani's Luminous Silk on Nisha. And we had a full a conversation about how I like full coverage. Yes. And she said, but you don't need it. You don't need it. You and look in the mirror and yeah. think you need it's it. It's an emotional mm -hmm. thing, I It is, like. I have this emotional attachment yes. to a, a lot of makeup when I don't need so it. So this Absolutely. is not full coverage. No. No. That's why it's so fresh. It's so and flawless. Glowy. But if you have a full coverage foundation like Estee Lauder, you can mix it with the Olay. And I would definitely use their Collagen Peptide 24 because you're going to get that hydration oh, mixed with it. Oh, look at that. And it gives you kind of a dewy finish, but it's not so cakey. So you're gonna look great with that what on. What a great pro tip. But you can also use it with your concealer, and that's what I'm gonna show you. So let's jump into the okay. do's and don'ts, Go ahead. right? So I'm gonna get started here. So this is what we're probably doing. We're all used to putting our concealer on right here. Yeah, like and I just all the way up, did that yesterday right? morning. I've got my hair now, you put it down by your nose. Because we've seen people do this on YouTube, on TikTok, it's everywhere. So we're like, this is how you wear your concealer, right? right. No because what it's gonna do is it's gonna settle into those fine lines and wrinkles, which okay, we now have. How do we avoid Ugh. that? So the better option is to take that Olay, and they actually okay. have the eye cream somewhere over and here. And you just dab that with your finger. That one I will do with my concealer. So I will take a little bit of my concealer, okay. a little bit of the eye cream, the eye cream, and mix, mix it, it together. together. And then you're gonna take that and dot it on. And you're just putting a little bit. I mean, that one that yeah, you, you did don't that's want the don't, cake. you had really caked it. This is But barely. look how in my fine lines and wrinkles, I mean, look see, at the difference. It actually, like I see light oh, yeah. under your right? eye. It opened up the eye and rather than And it's not settling. It. So then the next thing that we do that's a big don't is you take your powders mm -hmm. that are usually made for a foundation. Yes. And, and go over you the top. go over the top. That's what I do. Yeah, I do too. Well, and what it's is it your doing? instinct, right, to keep it set, and you have to yeah. you think again more, but then more it's settling better, in. But it's not. Okay, As so how age, do you set have, your concealer? So you're going to move to a translucent. Oh. Okay, and you can still use your full coverage around your face if you want to, but under the eye area, let's keep it very light. Who's and fresh, your favorite right? translucent? Um, this one is Laura Mercier. That's a good one. Okay, but any I mean, look, look at, at the, the difference. Look at yeah. the difference. Okay, look into that camera. This camera right here, you guys can see the difference between the eyes. One, Crazy, right? Honestly, yeah. one looks tired. 
and the right? other, yeah. that's, looks like you got a great night's sleep, which yes. is what you want is when it yes. comes to your eyes. Uh, so I want to share this tip before we have to go. Yes. Blush. Blush. Let's jump into it. So a lot of people use pink thinking that that this is... This changed our life this I know, morning. I know. Because I thought pink was youthful. Okay, it is, but it can actually age you when you're aging. So it, it makes it look like you're trying too hard. This is breaking news. So we're going to go, I'm instead stop of doing using your my pinks, pink. we're jumping over to these apricot colors. Like okay. almost coral But here's color. the thing, instead of placing it right here with pink like you normally would do on the apples of the cheek and over, we're coming like temples. Like and you're starting you're coming there. up, way up higher. And so you can see on Nisha's face, that's what I've done today is we've placed this blush. Well, I noticed I'm that first high. thing, your blush is in a different spot a different today spot. and it mm -hmm. changes. I can't believe it's you noticed lifted. that because look, you said that to me, you said you went higher with your blush and yes. I said, Missy did that, I usually go right Well, look right how lifted below. your cheekbones oh, are. It's just gonna lift your that cheekbones all the way up. are totally popped. Mm -hmm. So that's a great tip right there is just elevating Lifting Throw my because pink as in we the age, trash. we're sagging. Throw it in the trash. Get some bronzer. <laughs> get some coral. Okay, Absolutely. we have to link to all of the products, all of the things because I I need that. Rebelbeauty.com. That's where you find Missy. She's also on social media. She's such a great teacher. I didn't just get my makeup done. I learned. I learned how to do my makeup today. ABC4.com/gtu, and we'll put all her info right there. Thank you for being here. Thank for you. Nisha love day. you. And Nisha I love it. Day. I love it.